Hello, it's July the 7th now, so I thought it's time for another allotment update. It's been two or three weeks since I did my last one. So these are my sunflowers, getting nice and big now. As you can see, this one here is as tall as me, which is about six foot, and it's starting to get some heads on it. It's one, two, three heads, so they'll be nice. Nice red, yeah, re nice red type, sorry. Um, and then moving on to this bed, um, the sweet corn, starting to get nice and big now. Um, so I'm pretty pleased with that. Um, and then chamomile down here, still kind of small, so I don't know if that's really going to do anything. Um, and this here, this is a squash. Uh, you can see it's just starting to a little fruit on there, so that'll be nice. Uh, another squash there. Let's come round. It's a pumpkin in there, no flowers on that one yet. It's a courgette here. Um, and then five courgettes down there. I think there's fruit on one or two of them. Uh, this one has masses of flowers and yeah that's my first fruit so probably start to get loads of courgettes soon probably too many um, here's my leeks they really desperately need to go in the tips are starting to yellow a bit um, so they need to go in in the next couple of days I think another couple of sunflowers my nasturtions, they're going absolutely crazy. Look at all the flowers on them, they're really pretty. And the nasturtions are starting to try and spread all the way along there now, so they're sort of going absolutely mental. And then my runner beans, they're all looking pretty healthy now. Um, lots of flowers on them, sort of white flowers. None of them have set yet, but looking pretty good. They're all kind of at the top of the cane now. And then down on this frame, I've got um, cucumbers. You can see that starting to get a good size. They're a ridge type, a little bit spiky, but they're really tasty. I grew them last year. Um, another one here another little one under there and there's there's another plant but it's kind of getting swamped by these nasturtions so I'll cut the nasturtions back a little bit to give it a bit of room and there's one more cucumber plant here and a nice sized cucumber on there so yeah quite a few cucumbers growing so I'm really pleased with them um, so yeah, again the nasturtions back here are going crazy as well. Um, and then the runner beans looking good. Um, this is this was the potato bed. I dug them all up, showed that in another video. Um, I'm gonna dig this over and put leeks in and maybe some flowers and stuff. Got a few things ready to go in. Over here. It's another pumpkin. And a reject one that just chuck in, chucked in and it looks all right. Um, a few parsnips, all looking okay. And then the garlic, it's kind of fallen over. So I'll need to harvest that, I'll do that maybe today. And then all my onions. Onions looking good. Like this one, it's starting to proper bulb up now. I mean that's, that's eatable that size but they're still looking pretty green, so I'll give them a few more weeks. A couple of them have flopped over, but I'll wait until at least half of these have flopped over and then I will harvest them. But yeah, really pleased with the onions. Looking good. And these are the red onions. Um, they're a little bit behind. These were started from seed rather than these ones were from set, but I mean, even these, as you can see, they're starting to bulb. Whether they'll be as big, I don't know, but anyway, let's go over to the next plot. All right, we're at my other plot now. Um, these are my strawberries. 
Um, they're mulched with straw. Um, and I've had a few fruits off them already. And there's a few more on here. There, there's a few there and over here. So looking pretty good. Sorry about the sniffles, I've got a bit of a cold. Um, a few reject um, sweet corns came in here. So yeah, they're looking all right. So I might get a few corn from this. Um, and over here is my main crop potatoes. Um, I cut all the blighted leaves off, but it doesn't seem to have helped. As you can see, like, I think they've, they're pretty much done for. I should probably harvest them, or at least cut the tops down. And as you can see from here, lots and lots of brown leaf spot. And this blight, it's all over the site. Like, as you can see there. So, you know, I don't think I'm gonna get a very good crop of these because they're the golden wonder. They're a main crop, so they need to be in the ground for a lot longer, but yeah, oh well, you know, it happens. And then I've got my tomatoes here, and that's kind of why I want to get these potatoes out because blight can spread to these tomatoes, and I really want a nice crop of tomatoes, so. Right now, they're looking pretty good, these tomatoes. All the way down the row. These ones are getting nice, nice and tall. Um, and then on the edges, I've got calendula, which are looking healthy. I'm really pleased with them. And as you can see, one of them is starting to flower. So, and the other ones have flower buds. So, yeah, should get lots of flowers. Again, the tomatoes from this side. The first trusses you can see there. So, yeah, they're doing quite healthily. Some more flowers there. So I'm pretty pleased with them. Hopefully they don't get blighted and I get lots of nice tomatoes. And then in here is my broccolis and calabries. That one's looking all right. The rest of them are not looking so great. They got hammered by slugs and so yeah, I'm not holding out too much hope, but you never know. And over here, my chilies and sweet peppers. Uh, I cut the tops off and then as you can see, they're branched out and they're nice and bushy now. So I'm pleased with that. Some of them are starting to get flowers on them. Like this one, lots of little flowers on them. So yeah, this one's looking nice. So hopefully lots of chilies. We get a nice summer, I think I'll get a few chilies off them. Um, then in here, you can see, oh, we come underneath. My kale. So yeah, that's not looking too bad. Quite pleased with that. It got absolutely hammered by slugs um, and it seems to have bounced back. And then in here, lots of nasturtiums again, which are doing really well. And then my French beans, which are doing okay. You know, not as, not as good as they probably should, but might get a few beans off them. We'll, we shall see. Um, so yeah, that's that's my plot. Everything's doing all right, um, and I'll catch you in the next video.